This book is called Shark Swimathon by Stuart J. Murphy. Illustrated by Lynn Kravath. This is me turning the page. After practice on Monday, all the Ocean City Sharks could talk about was the state swim camp. We'd get to meet the best swimmers around, said Gil, and we'd learn a lot about swimming, added Stripes. Gil and Stripes were co-captains of the team. But we'd need, we'd need money to get there, Tiny pointed out, and we'd need money for lunches, said Flip and Flap, the Hammerhead Twins. They were always hungry. We'd need a lot of money, Finn said, and we just don't have it. Just then, Coach Blue swam in, waving a copy of the Ocean City News. Here's our chance to get to swim camp, she said. Oops, sorry. To celebrate its 75th anniversary, the Ocean City Bank has made a special offer. It will send any swim team to camp if the team swims a total of 75 laps by the end of the week. That's a lot of laps, said Tiny doubtfully, and we only have four days left. But there are six of us, Finn pointed out. I know you can do it if you all work together, Coach Blue told them. Tiny took a deep breath and shouted, We're sharks and we're fearless. All right, the rest of the team cheered. On Tuesday, while the team warmed up, Coach Blue wrote their goal on a big sign. Then she blew her whistle, and the sharks started swimming. All six sharks swam one lap, the length of the pool and back. Coach Blue shouted, Go, sharks, go! Tiny, Flip, and Flap all stopped after two laps. But Gill and Stripes kept, kept on swimming. They stopped after one more lap. Great swim, Coach Blue shouted. The Sharks watched as Coach Blue totaled up their laps on her clipboard. Then she subtracted the total from the 75-lap goal. Super job, Coach Blue announced. Now we just have 61 laps to go, said Flap, as she and Flip gobbled down a snack. Five ones minus four ones is one, and seven tens minus one ten is six tens. Sixty one laps. On Wednesday, the sharks couldn't wait to get into the pool. Sharks to the water, Coach Blue yelled as she blew her whistle. The sharks swam as hard as they could. Tiny stopped after two laps, but all the others swam three. Then they all crowded around as Coach Blue again totaled their laps on her clipboard. When she finished, she subtracted Wednesday's total from the number of laps they still needed to meet their goal. We have 44 laps to go, announced Coach Blue. I don't have enough ones, so I'll change 110 into 10 ones. 11 ones minus 7 ones is 4, and 5 tens minus 110 is 4 tens. All the sharks arrived early on Tuesday. I hope we can still make it, said Stripes, looking at the sign. I hope so too, Gil said. After the warm-up, Coach Blue shouted, Let's go! And the sharks dived in. This time, when no one got out after two laps, everyone swam three, except Gil. This time, he swam four. 
When they were done, the team waited while Coach Blue totaled the results. Then she subtracted the total from the remaining laps in their goal. 9 is greater than 4. I'll change a 10 into, into 10 ones. 14 ones minus 9 ones is 5. And 3 tens minus 1 ten is 2 tens. Great going, Coach Blue said. You did really well. We only have 25 more laps to go. As the Sharks rested, Flip said, I wonder what kind of food we'll get at swim camp. Maybe tacos. Tacos are my favorite, said Flap. Mine, too, agreed Flip. I like them as well, said Mr. Pearson. Oh, wait, that's not on there. On Friday, everybody warmed up and was ready to go. Everybody, that is, except Gil. Where could he be? asked Finn. Here I am, groaned Gil as he swam slowly in. What happened? Finn cried. I fell off my bike, Gil explained sadly. The doctor said I can't race for a whole month. Oh no, Tiny and Stripes moaned. There goes swim camp, sighed Flip. There goes the tacos, sighed Flap. The sharks gathered around Coach Blue. We can't do it without Gil, said Tiny, taking off her goggles. Oh, yes, we can, said Stripes firmly. She looked at the sign. We can make it if we each swim five laps. Remember, Gil said, we're sharks. And we're fearless, finished Tiny, putting her goggles back on. Gil watched and cheered as the other sharks attacked the water. Stripes finished her laps, her five laps, in record time. Flip and Flap finished their, snap, their laps next. Finn struggled to the end of his fifth lap. Tiny was the only one left swimming. Go, Tiny! The rest of the team chanted. Do it for Gil, Stripe called. Do it for the tacos! Flip and Flap yelled. Mmm, tacos. Finally, with a big gasp, Tiny made it to the end of her fifth lap. All the swimmers jumped back in the pool. Way to go, Sharks, Gil yelled. Working hard. Coach Blue blew her whistle to get the team's attention. Don't you want to see the results, she asked. The Sharks all rushed over to the sign. Coach Blue had already put up the team's numbers. Swim camp, here we come, Stripes called. Tacos, here we come, Flip and Flap cheered together. There are zero ones and zero tens left. The next day, the Sharks made the sports page of the Ocean City News. And the next month, the whole team made it to swim camp. The end.